Hello everyone and welcome back for another mod review. Today we're going to be taking a look at the Crone self-propelled round and square balers. These self-propelled balers make bales from hay, grass and straw. Both these vehicles have four-wheel drive and both these vehicles have all-wheel steering capability. This is the round bale maker. Let's take a little look around at it and then we'll look over a few things. This is the square one. Getting a little lag. This one is called the Chrome Baler version 3.0 prototype. And the other one's just called a Chrome Round Baler. This one you can connect a trailer to. So you can connect the uh, baler, the bale picker upper, which works pretty fine. I thought that might be a problem that that the thing that picks up the bales kind of hangs over the other side but the bales basically slide onto the back and as soon as they hit the trailer that thing recognizes them and it comes up and grabs it so that's pretty cool all right i'm going to take you guys over to the shop and we will take a look at the specs this is the this is the square one 360 kilowatts, 490 horsepower, $179,000 price tag, $79 a day maintenance fee. It picks up all three grass, hay, and straw. Has a four meter work width. And I think that's about it. This guy, oh, by the way, the person that made this is goes by the name iCookie. He made both of these actually. So I, from what I've seen so far, a really good job. This guy is $159,000, $180 a day maintenance fee. Picks up all three fruit types, 360 kilowatts, 490 horsepower, same as this guy. This guy, it doesn't say uh, what kind of a work width he has, but we can assume that it's the same for the most part. That header, yeah, that's all attached, it's all in one, so. Let us take a look inside of these. Now, this is a square one, like I said. Here's the interior view, not bad at all, looks like a chrome, nice smooth interior, Horn works, let's jump outside and test, oh no, we don't, we'll do it from here, test the beacons, good, uh, see the lights and stuff, I'd like to take a look at that, make sure it all works good, okay, it looks good, now as far as the other guy, inside the interior not as nice as that guy it's kind of incomplete but that's fine the uh, dashboard looks fine the speedometer works and everything but uh yeah it's not as sharp as the other one but it's still nice nonetheless by the way this makes bales at 25 kilometers an hour that one makes bales at 20 so that one is a little faster but let's take these out onto the field and put them to the test so I have some straw set up. We'll we'll make straw bales first. Let me get my screen back up here. Oh, by the way. Okay, let me try some of the uh, some of these things. L. Okay. As you can see right now, I have all wheel wheel steering. If I hit L, I can switch it so just the front tires will turn. I hit L again. It's just so the back tires will turn. I hit it again and it's back to all four wheels again so just keep that in mind you can switch if you want to uh, let's turn on our work lights seven and eight I don't have it on there okay seven and eight okay and there's a there's a light inside the cab I didn't show you that that's really more noticeable in the nighttime but it is there so it's worth showing okay let's unfold our bale picker upper let's lower our header let's unfold our baler turn on our beacons fire it up and we're making bales. Nice animation on the front. We 
got some uh, smoke coming off of it. Looks pretty cool. You can see it filling up. No, I didn't show you that yet, sorry. Yeah, if you press spacebar, you can go into IC mode and you can control your, your cursor then. Now you can hit these buttons here and you have a reverse view. You have four different camera angles. The fifth one doesn't work for some odd reason. But that's kind of cool. Okay, we almost got our second bail made. Or, or yeah, it's going to kick back and then you can turn this off too. So I'm going to come out of IC mode because I want to back up and I want to see if he's going to grab that bail. Grab it. Okay, I may have to. Oh, I hope that don't fall off when I take the corner. You're going to fall off. Be nice if he grabbed it there, but. Oh, he did. Nice. Sorry for taking that so wide. That's not what I meant to do. But anyway, we get the idea with this guy. He's making bales. Our bale collector seems to be handling it all right. Let's make one more just to be sure. The other guy got a meaner horn on him. As soon as he hits that hitch, basically, right there. Grab it. See? Works good. Okay, let's go to our round baler. Let's fire him up. This guy doesn't have half as many options, but he's still cool. We'll press 7 and 8 to get our lights on. That's about all you can do. Listen to the horn on this one. Haha. <laughs> We already got dirty looking. Cool. I like that. We checked out our signal lights and everything on this, right? Yeah, everything works. Good. Hazards work. How come our back light's not on? Oh, it is on. You just can't see it too well. Let's lower our implement. Get this thing on. So this guy's going to pick up a little quicker than the other guy. This guy's so smooth and quiet. But... Unfortunately, you can't haul a trailer behind this guy, but that's fine. And these things handle like a dream. They're so easy to maneuver. So, this guy, when he hits 80%, he's going to make an annoying buzzing sound. And that's warning you that it's almost filled. Once he's to 100%, it's not going to collect anymore, so you just stop. Oh, frames. Back up a little bit. Hit... Oh, okay, we're going to flip over. Oh no, we didn't pick up enough, my bad. Need a little more. There we go. Yeah, it gets annoying after a while. Hit O to eject your bail. Hit O again to close it. It's not going to pick up anymore until that's sealed again, so keep that in mind. And we're making bales again. So, we're making square and round bales with straw with ease. Make one more. Hundred percent stop. Back up. Press O. Inject the bail. Pull ahead a little bit. Press O again. And everything's still on. You just right into it. Okay, I have a couple of other ones set up over here. Okay, now we're gonna test some hay. We're gonna Lower you. I'm going to switch back to my tractor. I'm going to unfold. I'm going to turn my beacons on. I'm going to lower my implement. I'm going to kick on my baler. And I'm going to hit the field. Okay, we're making hay bales. Square hip hay bales with, with no problems. So far, so good. One bale made. Second bale, let's complete it. Let's go into our third one so we can see this animation. So we can grab it. Yes. Fine, fine job. Okay.
Let's make some round hay bales. Beacon's on. Lower your implement. And kick you on. This guy's so basic, but so cool. And quick, too. It's like a little vacuum cleaner. So we're making we're making round hay bales with ease. Close you back up. And away we go. Make one more. And then we'll test the grass and that'll be that. There we go. Let's see this guy makes the bale so quick, man. Booting along at 25. Okay. Now, the grass test. Open you up. Switch over to tractor. Unfold. Beacons on. Lower implement. Bale are on. We're making grass bales. So, the square baler has come out on top. It seems to make everything with ease. Haven't seen any glitches or anything thus far. Looks like we got a hit here. Yeah, fine addition. Fine addition to the farm. Grab it. Grab it. i to take the corner, I hope. Yes. Okay. Now, one more. Let's make some round grass bales. Lower implement, beacons on, let's go. These things are great, I mean, right now you're saving on a job, you're freeing up a tractor. And with the other one, you're, you're, that's the work of two tractors, because I mean, you're picking up the bales as well. So there's your grass bales, guys. So it seems to do well on everything. Both of these pass with flying colors, I would have to say. Make one more and wrap it up. And it does it fast. There we go. Inject. Well, there you have it, guys. The Crone self-propelled self round and square balers. All the information will be down below as well as the links. I hope you enjoyed that and I'll see you in the next one. Take care.